Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm back with another Dragalia Lost video. Today, it's going to be all about um, Human Mercury right here. I pulled her, so I'm going to be using her. I'm still trying to figure out the best way to build her. So currently, she's a mixture of dragon damage and skill increase. The reason is, is that uh, this this ability right here, Team Strength Amp equals 100, Burn Resistance 100%. It actually takes an extremely long time to give the entire team a strength amp. You have to use her move basically three times, and that move has an extremely slow cooldown. So currently she's in a hybrid of half dragon, half skill. Not 100% sure which way I want to lean currently, but that's the current way I've got it built. So I also have a, some part of me wants to kind of have the chocolatier or something like that to give her... 50% or maybe even go full 100% but that's the current build idea I'm currently going with so tell me yours how you've been building her I would be glad to hear what other people are building her as she seems pretty fun and if you can actually get her working 100% right the one thing I wish that there was more in the game is that there was more shared skills to give strength amp currently there's not really much and the only other water unit that gives a strength amp is Ellie and I do not have her mana spiral yet so we're gonna jump in start here with the Mercale Hopefully by the end you'll see how long it takes for me to get my skill up. Or he might die from the dragon part. We'll see. But it does take an extremely long time. Okay, let's go here. Take damage, of course. Use this. Get buffed up. Perfect, perfect. We're almost there to our first strength amp. There we go. Use that. Go there. Come on, we got this. Go here. Go here. And then go here. And then we'll go dragon. Go here. The one thing I wish water had, which is I know why they don't have it, because it would be too good, is that they had the Mars equivalent of every time you shapeshift you got all your skills back. But that ability is too good to actually make into anything. So I understand why they don't make it into anything. Go here. So as you see here, he's almost dead, and he is not anywhere close to being, um, nowhere close to being, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, we're nowhere close to the next skill amp. <laughs> no one has the skill amp currently, not everyone, not, not yet, I think in the next skill they should. Uh, that should be over right there. Yeah, as you can see here, it's currently level 2 and not party wide. Not yet anyway. Go here. There. And I think it won't matter because he's going to die from the dragon right here anyway. So that's kind of the one thing that I've had an issue with, is that specific problem of the skill amp. I just never get it until it's too late. And there you go. I think everyone had it there at the end, but... Yeah, amp level 1. How dare you not show me. That's just mean. But yeah, I... Currently, Strength Amp is in a weird place because not a lot of units have it. I wish there were more units that have it. Um, obviously, we will eventually get to the point where we will get it. So as they add more water units with Strength Amp, she'll just get better and better. Or more units with a Strength skill that gives that. Um, but at the moment, man, I really do like her because that Dragon form is just so good. Which is why it makes me want to kind of go like, I'm going to want to build more towards Dragon as opposed to building towards that. But the reason why I kind of... So here's the main problem, Brunhilda. I'm gonna see if I can survive it, but I'm almost positive I'm not going to be able to. Um, she doesn't have burn resistance at all, so she's gonna get completely eaten up by here. I couldn't change it up. I can probably give her an Affliction Guard, actually. Let me give her an Affliction Guard. Affliction. Just for this fight, just because Brunhilde will literally drop her down to 1 HP, which I think is going to happen to Eileen, but I don't mind it happening to Eileen, so... It's just going to happen to Eileen. That's just the way it's going to go for this. So let's go into it and see how it goes. But this is a very weird, odd-specific pace because uh, Brunhilde always starts the fight with fire no matter what. So yeah, that's kind of why I wish there was a way to just... Maybe one day when we have three shared skills that give um, strength amps, she'll be able to start automatically with the entire team amp having the um, the fire resistance, the burn resistance. I mean, I mean fire burn. It's the same thing. Some would disagree though. Okay, she's gonna do her giant exploding move right now. Yeah, there it is. Get out of the way. 
quickly beat her up. Now, her moves also get stronger depending on if something's active, so let me just quickly use this because she's just going to be a him, but I, let's just get rid of her right now. She should not be able to handle it. I'm surprised she actually was able to handle it. Go here. But she's not going to be able to handle it for very much longer. So slap her up with that a little bit. Then we'll go into our second state, which does give Bog, I think. Let's see. I thought it gave Bog. Weird. I know her actual dragon form gives Bog, but unless um, Brunhilde has a 100% Bog resistance that I don't know of. But we'll find out. But yeah, no real issue on this one for um, Brunhilde here. The only issue is the opening blast where she gives the burning thing, so. Let's go on to the other team. The last one we're gonna fight here is the twins. Now the twins actually for some reason give me an extremely hard, tr big trouble and it's especially hard for this team um, because I didn't expect her to be dagger so Tiki doesn't actually have a good dagger at the moment. I have to fix that at some point. I also haven't beaten it on master as you can see here. Um, the reason is, is that I don't have a very good water healer. I have Eileen and that's about it. <laughs> She's doing her best. Um, but in terms of being able to auto it, it's just not going to cut it. It's just not going to cut it, if I'm being 100% honest with you. But manually, I should be able to beat it. No real issue here. I mean, I say that now. Watch me just get completely destroyed in the beginning. <laughs> I really hope it doesn't happen, but when I tested it, it worked out perfectly fine. Let's, play let's, let's, let's check. So they're going to start by being a bunch of bastards. I'm going to go here to hopefully not get afflicted. I didn't get afflicted. Perfect. Beat up on her a little bit. There we go. Exactly what I wanted. I forgot to... Oh no, she still has the Affliction Guard. I need to turn that off. If I lose here, then I'll take it off and get the Dragon Damage over it. So I'm using that a lot because I think every time I use the bunnies, it gives me more boost to my actual skills being used. So that's why I do it. God damn it. I was about to say, I'm probably going to lose right there, if I'm being honest. It was a huge mess up on my part. There's a strength amp, and here's a dragon. And boom. So she does, she does give bog. I guess Brunhilde was just immune to it, and I never knew. Oh, wait, no. Hmm. Oh, I hate this. Okay, so let me go back. Perfect. Give up. And let me put on the actual dragon damage. I hate that specific. You're supposed to be able to beat them by that part, but I didn't have enough damage right there, so... <sighs> it's unfortunate. So let me go here. Go yon. No, let me go here. Nope. Why am I so bad at this still? Let me see. Dragon. I just gotta put in dragon. Dragon. Here we go. No! I was about to optimize the entire team and that would have been very bad for me. Alright, let's go in. So yeah, I feel like if I had Ellie helping with the team app stuff, it would be super helpful. But both... <laughs> they gave both Ellie and um, Mercury their team app on their slowest skill in the entire game. So... That's kind of unfortunate. Here. Oops. I oh, okay, I didn't get hit by burning, which is good. Go there. Keep on beating him up a little bit. Perfect. Yeah, I should be able to go. Yep. Oh, they're too far away now. Come on. There we go. Oh no, I didn't hit him. Oh no, I didn't. Oh, that's not good. Get out of the way. 
Ah, oh, damn it, I was hoping to beat him fast enough. I don't think I was able to. Use that. Watch him transform. Big old Mothra. Okay, go here. Beat him up a little bit. Go dragon, because I have dragon now. Oh, they're gonna go away from me. God damn it. That move is also extremely slow. So I just timed it badly, though. Go here. Ooh, that's not good for her. Strength amp. I don't think it's at level 2 yet, though. Oh, let me just go... It might be actually based off of her getting the little shield now that I saw it. Oh, don't tell me. You cowards! I call this move the AI killer because none of them know how to freaking act during it. They should be dead pretty soon here. Let's end it with the dragon. Yeah, they can't handle this much dragon. Oh, come on! God, every single time I mistimed that move. Perfect. Alright, you're dead. Get out of my face. Leave! My sight. Well, part of leave my sight did you not understand. So yeah, by the end there, no one had the team amp. But yeah, that's, that's Mercury right now. I really like her. I'm probably going to focus more of her being an attack unit. Um, it seems like... I'm, I'm not sure if I... Actually, I don't know. I'll see how... I'll keep experimenting around. I really would like to just go full dragon, but... that Her being the main source of team amp for the team would be really killer because most of the time she'll be in dragon mode. So... That's not great. <laughs> but that's my current thoughts on her, is that... I guess my final thoughts on her is that I really like her. I really like the way she's built. Um, she's built very interesting. If you want to go more in the human side of her, you can build her that way. But if you want to go more dragon side, also perfectly possible to do. It also is taking me a while to get used to. I've never used um, Mercury the dragon ever. I remember fighting her. And now, <laughs> it's weird to see the, me using the attack and I was like, oh yeah, that was an extremely long windup. When I was fighting her, it didn't seem like that long of a windup, but now that I'm actually using her, it's like, oh yeah, I can kind of see the fault with this specific attack. But yeah, that's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. If you did, you can leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video, in the next adventure. Goodbye, everyone. Peace out.